This place is real beautiful. There's nothing, not a care in the Wait, world. And what the right? hell? A Whoa. gargoyle? A... Oh no! This is no Whoa, way to intro an you, app. Oh my goodness. Do you think this gargoyle knows that it's featured on Permrad Games? I hope so. If it can take solace in anything in its life, or its death, it should be that it was on our channel. <laughs> and it was seen by three people. Are we included in that total? Yeah, of course. Damn. Too real, Rob. <laughs> well, just check Speaking out. Speaking of he real, Rob. Any of our video. That's a TV show. Real Rob. Yeah, Rob Schneider. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> a lot of guys with name Robert, who like go by Bob or like Rob or Robbie, Rob, Bobby, Bobby Diesel. Sure. That happens sometimes. That's not me, though. I'm not Big Bob Whoa! Diesel. Whoa! If the police ask you about Big Bob Diesel, that's not me. <laughs> I never die in Dark Roll Souls. Roll the clip. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, that attack really surprised me, actually. But that's the thing that Dark Souls starts to do later on. Starting here, I guess, more with the post <laughs> Yeah, if you get farther, you might actually die. No, it's, um... They start recycling bosses. Oh. So, that's... Can't wait. Like... They recycle bosses as regular enemies. Like, that was a bell gargoyle. Gotcha, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, you know how you're talking, like, are there more bell gargoyles? I guess this is, like, a normal bell... It, or it's not a bell gargoyle, it's just a gargoyle. There are just so many. Yeah. And then, you know the Capra Demon? The thing, like, with all the dogs around it? Yeah. That's, like, a thing later on. Same with the Taurus Demon. Ooh. Like, there's just a bunch of them. Damn. And some people think it's really lazy, I guess. But it also, it's, like... Yeah, these guys are trash now. I'm good. Okay. Did that stagger him? Really? I think Whoa. I should... I think I should just forget about fire. <laughs> just big boy him. Really? For now, at least. But what about the other spells, the other fire spells? Uh, there's like Great Fireball. No, I mean, you already bought another one. Does the other one do better? Oh, it's um, Combustion. It's a point blank ta attack. Oh, okay. That just, like, you spit a hot fire. Whoa. But how does that work with, when you're using your glove? Do you have to put the glove in your mouth? On it? Yeah, it's like right by your mouth. Like, huh. Yeah. So you, like, make a circle? with your glove hand and then blow through it like you make it a bubble <laughs> i think the only th i just haven't equipped it and i can only equip it at bonfires uh, but like we have it and everything let's see i forgot what's in here Ooh. whoa another one i wonder if we can sell that for quick cash cash for gold i don't know we have like three of them don't we This is weird. Yeah, it's so weird. <laughs> like, when I was playing this game, my buddy Jack had to tell me, why don't you try to walk up the rafter? Like, How come you're playing the entirety of this game in front of Jack? Because I played it in our... We, we dormed together. Yeah. Do you have any uh, special times? Special times? No. Yeah. Well, you know, two guys <laughs> sleeping in the same room. <laughs> Whoa, Most these are... Painted? Yeah. Yeah. Like, Dark... I'm done. <laughs> it's like Dark Souls 3. The chapel that you have to, like, walk over in the railings. Yeah, this is actually super spooky, and I'm going to be clenched right now. I suggest you listening at home. Clench as well. Clench. Well, especially she projectiles. Oh, okay. Why did she run all the way over there to throw a projectile? I don't know. But this is so annoying because we have such a huge sword. It, like, swings us. Yeah. God damn it. <laughs> Woof. I think I'm going to be hyper-aggressive next time. 
whoa yeah yeah that doesn't that hasn't worked for you in the past no <laughs> it, i heard you talking about a game called blood Mirror. yeah and uh in blood Mirror, you, you uh use attacking a lot yeah but i mean those games are fundamentally different i think so i can't just force a different game's mechanics into this one yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> i can't will it to be I saw somebody try to play Bloodborne with a shield, and it was the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. Because there's only one shield in that Isn't game. Isn't like a piece of wood? Yep. Just a plank. I wish you could be a dad. I wish I could be a mommy. Well, we are. Ugh. Do we still have that mask on? Yeah. Oh, dang. We've been a mom this whole time. The whole—that's like a, a Shyamalan twist. Like Robert, what if you just someone? Took That's not a twist. <laughs> <laughs> what? Someone took you into a room and was like, "Rob, your whole life you've been a mother." <laughs> That's not a twist. <laughs> <laughs> you've seen a Shyamalan movie. You know what a twist is. Actually, have you seen Split? Uh, no. Can I ruin that movie for you? You ever gonna watch it? I mean, if it's on TV, I might watch it. But if it's on TV, what are you forty? <laughs> no, I mean like. How many times on, have you seen the Shawshank on Redemption? HBO. On, on like, HBO. I'm not, like I'm talking on-demand channels, bro. Oh, I don't know. But uh, I got really mad because it wasn't a twist. He was just crazy. No, it was so. Do you know the setup for Yeah, he's Split? like got multiple personalities. Yeah, so apparently and he says this throughout the entire movie that one of his personalities is called the beast and it's super strong. And the twist is that it's true. Oh, so yeah? when the personality takes over he gets super strong. And I'm like that's not a twist. <laughs> you can't tell me what a twist is the entire time in a movie. And then just say that it's not true, and then at the end say it's true. That's well, not a twist. That's the whole thing about 10 Cloverfield Lane, right? No. Yeah. I don't think there's a twist. That's, isn't, that's not a Shyamalan movie. No, that, that's, what I'm, that's what I'm talking about, though. It's the whole thing about 10 Cloverfield Lane. Is like this guy is saying, like, there's aliens outside, and the whole time you're like, no, there's not. And then at the end, there's aliens outside. Yeah, I wouldn't call that a twist either. But it's, it's like, I don't think... There has to be a twist. It, it sounds no, like... I'm just saying it's a Shyamalan movie, and everybody told me there's a giant twist. Oh, okay. And uh, it's a Shyamalan movie. Like I, like, I think of the in Sixth Sense. That's a major twist. But it yeah. sets it up the whole time. It never tells you what it is. But it gives you the impression that, you know, something's up, and then you find out he's dead, and you're like, oh, shit. That's cool. I wanted that moment in Split, but it wasn't there. I was just like, oh, okay. It was true. <laughs> the thing that he said the whole time was true. I should have listened. Yeah. Well, because I, I think... I, it was especially because the whole time they're like, well, when you, people with this split personality disorder can change their body chemistry to become what? entirely different people. Okay. But it, it had to do with, like, one, one personality is a diabetic and the other ones aren't. One personality's got this like such a pain in the oyster ass. allergy, and the other one doesn't. So <laughs> it's like, so the whole time they're like, literally, hey, that thing that that person said could be true, <laughs> and then it happens at the end, and you're like, oh. What if you're just like enjoying sushi or something, and then halfway through you're like, shit, I'm allergic now. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it would be like if in the sixth sense, like Haley Joel Osment halfway through was like. It kind of seems like you're dead. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> no way. <sighs> Barf. I think he only has a couple. Four. Five. Six, Maybe he has infinite. Seven. Eight. <laughs> nine. Okay. He's got at least nine. <laughs> Cut! <laughs> Whoa, there's a large magic ember? How many embers are there? A lot. Like six? Okay. Woo, 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 Yo. Woo. We're back, and Evan has devised a plan. Yeah, Evan's never going to die again. 
Yeah, you, oh, you heard it here. You heard it here first, folks. Yep. I'm never gonna die on this balcony ever again. Sweet. Uh, rafters, rather. I'm hyped. Combustion. <gasps> Whoa! It did like half damage. Oh no! They have Estes. So yeah. I realized the thing that made me be bad was because we have a giant ass sword. It's just swinging you around, dude. It was swinging you as much as you were swinging it. Oh no, we broke a chandelier. Who's gonna pay for that? <laughs> oh, I just realized we walk like a woman. Yeah, you're like a drunk uncle. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Didn't mean for that to happen. Three. I think you just four, have to advance. Five. Six. Whoa. Get wrecked, mate. Yeah, seriously. No, no. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Just get down, grab the rail. No, no, no. Five throw knife's so worth it. I'm just not even taking my chances, dude. Hang on, that statue looks like a person. Yeah, maybe her name's Guinevere. Oh. Do you think she knows Glenn? Probably. Or are they the same... Person? Do you think that's... Oh, that is actual size. I was going to make a joke like, Oh man, she's probably way smaller <laughs> than those knights, isn't she? Ha <laughs> ha, why would they make her statue so big? And then I'm like, oh yeah, she is actually really big. So the theory is that she and Seath uh, have a kid. And that kid's another boss in this game named Priscilla. Whoa. Who's Seath? The scaleless dragon. Whoa, what? Yeah. How do you... I don't know, dude. She's big. That doesn't mean I... <laughs> She's big. They're wholly different series. You know how, like, there are, like, sometimes, like, two mammals yeah. can mate, but they have, like, different chromosome numbers, so, like, the kid the, can't have the, any like, kids. like, life finds a way. Right, 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 right. Now, that never works with <laughs> entirely different branches of... Have you seen Jurassic Park? Okay, yeah, those are still they're still <laughs> dinosaurs. They're still each reptile. Just joshing. I feel like I've seen this before somewhere, huh? Yeah, Silver Knight flashbacks. Oh my gosh, dude! Proof of Concord caps, just the dumbest thing that exists. So over on this side in Dark Souls Three, there's a red-eyed Silver Knight. Yeah. Um, Here, there's just goons. There's just goons. That look like see the scale is kind of a little bit, yeah. They're like white, but like with blood. You can walk off. <laughs> Roll the clip. Yeah. <laughs> I was just turning around. I didn't know you could walk off that. Oh my god! I don't think you can walk off that. Those are there are railings. You obviously can walk <laughs> off that. It's just ornament. Nobody's supposed to walk on that. You. What? I don't think you you're have supposed to climb the rafters again. No, we got a shortcut. Okay, cool. I honestly don't know how I died there. I, that's you walked off the can edge. I, can I say it again for this let's play? I've never died there. I, I've, <laughs> I've never died there. You're never gonna die again. No, honestly, there's like, because every time you play Dark Souls, you have different builds and different parts of the game give you grief. Mm hmm And that's very true with this build. Because I've played as a giant dad, but I was in New Game Plus, so I already had everything I needed. Mm -hmm. uh, and this time we're just kind of... What are we? We're level 39. Not too good. Hey, better than one, right? Yeah, better than one. I'd say like 39 times better than one. After you go through the game, Soul Level 1, you're going to go through New Game Plus on Soul Level 1? I don't think so. I think that's too much. Um, I, well... <laughs> Like, it's interesting to see where really intense gamers draw the line. Because <laughs> apparently Soul Level 1 on Dark Souls isn't too far. No. But New Game Plus? Come on. See, in Dark Come Souls, on. I'm at Gwyn. I just haven't tried to fight him yet mm -hmm. because I forgot about the DLC. So I'm at Manus, and I haven't fought Manus either because I know that's going to suck. Jeez. But you got all the best gear. Yeah. See, I'm, I'm walking against the edge. Don't right now. You dare tempt this one more time. I'm just saying, I don't think you can fall through that. 
I guarantee if you look directly at the railing and then walk forward, it'll push. It'll you'll take it off. That's exactly what you did. Oh, there's two. Damn it. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh my goodness. We're yeah, fine. It's never gonna end. We're fine. Oh shit. Shit. Oh shit. We're not fine. <laughs> This is like in a cartoon <laughs> <laughs> when a character like runs in a hallway and then comes face to face with the person they're trying to run from and then runs in the opposite direction and the same thing happens. It's like that. This game is a cartoon, man. This is one of the worst parts of the game right now. The, yeah. I love Anne Arlanda. These are the silver... These. Oh, God. Robert, this is the birth of a meme right here. Oh, man, that's right. They have the giant arrows. And Orlando Archers, please be merciful. I'm not even fucking with this Vihander because I would die for sure. Yeah, no time. Whoa. Please die. This is so hard. Yes. Nice. Yes. Yes, we did it first try, boys. Lucky. That was very lucky. All right, we did it. We beat, we beat Dark Souls, guys. We did it. Whoa, yay! We made it to the heart of Anne Orlando. Who could it be? Oh, <gasps> Sun Bro! Oh, there you are, dude. You made it. How did you get to Anne Orlando? Yeah, he can help us with Ornstein and Smo if we want, but oh, yeah. I don't. I don't know. Well, I think you might need the help at this point, though. What the? Fuck? <laughs> I don't know if I can watch you die again. <laughs> the fuck, dude? Or are we still in the edit where you hypothetically edited out <laughs> all of you die? I don't know. It, that but... would be insane if you did that. <laughs> yeah. And then just bleep me when I talk about <laughs> you dying. <laughs> just censor it. Yeah. I could be like the Kim Jong Un of Dark Souls. <laughs> 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 That's amazing. You just overdub my voice with you saying like I'm Evan's really good at golf. <laughs> this is really sweet, right? Kate, how is how is Guinevere supposed to walk around this place? Uh I don't think she's actually that big. How'd she get into the room? She's way bigger than those door frames. Nah, well we'll see. Shouldn't everything in this castle be giant? Guinevere, I don't actually know how big she is. Why would you make a smaller one? What do you mean you don't know how big she is? Because that Guinevere that we see is an illusion. Oh, well. But she's probably still pretty big. Probably. I mean, the statue's big, too. It makes me wonder, though, because Gwyn is big, but he's yeah. not that big. How big is he? He's like, uh, like 1.5 times as big as us, maybe. That's like, pretty big. Bigger than these guys. Yeah, well... He's honestly similar to these guys. I'm kind of wasting that. Yeah. Wow. I thought for sure. It's not over yet. <laughs> Would you please kill the guy shooting arrows at you? Uh, yeah, in a sec. Damn it. Oh my gosh, dude. God, having a big sword sucks so much sometimes. You were obviously supposed to kill that guy first. Says who? Miyazaki? Says basic battle strategy. God damn. That one was a headshot. Oh, hey. Yo. Sig... Sigmeyer. Yep. So, he's stuck here, and he mm -hmm. says there's a bunch of bad guys. Or just one maniac with no Estus. Whoa. 
shit. Uh, no, we need like three or five more bodies, probably. Yeah, probably a couple more bodies. He doesn't help you out? Huh? No, I need to get there with more Estus. But no, he doesn't help you out, which is kind of weird. That is weird. Maybe that's how you can tell the difference between Sigmar and Sigurd. <laughs> no, because he'll help you out later. It's just in this situation, he's just like, ah, oh, I don't know about this undead guy. Let's see. You know what might be a good idea? Is just kindling up this bonfire. <laughs> Is this a hard boss? Yeah, it's the hardest in the game. Whoops. God damn. <laughs> My bane. <laughs> Menus. It's a long process. But yeah, <laughs> uh, killing pinwheel lets us kindle bonfires. I think we went over that. We've been playing this game in a really weird order. <laughs> But you can kindle it up to 20 Estes. How many things do you have to kindle it with? It's just humanity. Oh. So how many do you have? Uh, I don't know. 16. Whoa. 16 is not a lot. Uh, especially because with the giant, uh, the giant dad build, you need t uh, 10 humanity on you at all times. What? Yeah. Why? Because the cool thing about the giant dad build is your sword uh, scales entirely with humanity. Uh, and it gotcha. caps at 10. And so yeah, chaos infusions are super good. If you have 10 humanity. Which isn't Sorry. that difficult to do. It's just like, you have to always recover your souls if you die. So you think I should go kill the arrow guy? Yes! Is that what you think? Obviously! Pancaked. Straight up. Where's the other guy? I don't know. Taking the day off. Cool. Got lucky. Are you serious? You're fucking pulling out your bow in front of me. Why, wow, dude? That was disrespect. Him or me? Him, dude. Yeah. Pulling out a ranged weapon directly in your face? I feel like I disrespected him for being disrespectful. Yeah. That's fair. The backstab. Isn't isn't that how uh, the world goes around? Yeah. Disrespect. <laughs> <laughs> who run who who runs the world? Disrespect. Good old BM. God damn. You ever play Hearthstone? No, that's for nerds. Okay, cool. But <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> guess we're not going to talk about that. Uh, have you? Yeah, I was just going to talk about no, it. No, I did try it. but uh, There's a lot of BM in that game. Bow movements? No, bad manners. Uh oh. Uh, so you can't actually like say whatever you want. There's no chat box, but there are emotes. Mm -hmm. And one of people's favorites is when they're beating you, they spam, Sorry! Sorry! <laughs> Sorry! Ugh. <laughs> it's like in Rocket League. I hate it. Whenever someone blows something, uh, they'll just spam, what a save, what a save, what oh, a save. Yeah, it's exactly like that. Sarcasm abounds. Speaking of Rocket League, uh, Permarad fan meetup in LA at <laughs> RLCS. I'm going to the Rocket League World Championship. Yeah, someone will be there, right? Maybe. I hope it's not only me and Ben showing up. I think you can just assume that everybody else there is a fan of Permarad Games. Yeah. I'll, that would be really funny. You should funny. hand out cards? Yeah. No, I should do a fan meetup and <laughs> just like try to make it look legit. You should just hand out cards while you're there. I bet one person checks. I bet if you hand out 100, one person checks it out. Think we'd get a sub? I, I don't know. They'd at least check it out. Oof. I just want a backstab. These guys are everywhere. 
That's how you play Dark Souls, boys and girls. Yep, bag's dead. What? <laughs> that was clearly a mess. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Sigurd, we did it. We saved. Yay. We saved him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I defeated him. Whoa. So that's just like a little health ring. Weakness bravery. That's funny. That's that's a good one, right? It's a funny joke. Coward. Yeah, there's one of those. We didn't have to do that, but I figured we might as well do Sigurd's quest line. Sure. He's a cool guy. Yeah. God damn it. That's not his name. Sigmeyer. We're doing Sigmeyer's quest line. Oh, I line. don't care about Sigmeyer. <laughs> that guy was Sigmar. I don't like him. Something, something about that guy. When are we gonna meet his daughter? What, is this a summon sign? Dude, people play this game. Yeah, of course. <laughs> That's why I told you you wouldn't be able to actually handle PvP. Because the people who are still playing Dark Souls are like freaking intense. Oh shit. I feel like the only casuals that play Dark Souls at this point are like Let's Players. Yeah. Freaking nerds. Yeah. Seriously. The weebs. <laughs> That's just brutal. Dude, we actually summoned him. That's awesome. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he saved <laughs> your life. <laughs> Thank you. Man, you were so screwed. Does he have a, a, a binder? Yeah, I think so. Dang, he it's knows. Like we just need to open up this shortcut. Oh, dang, he's going for it. Yeah, he is. He's going to him. It's a Silver Knight's chest. Whoa. So I guess we're going to fight Ornstein and Smo with a Phantom. That'll be fun. Sweet. We should mes message him after. Yeah. Be like, hey, bro, thanks. Check out Promoter Games. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? It's like D something. DBRC12? Dude, he's a YouTube star now. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I wish we were YouTube stars. Can't make somebody else a YouTube star. Oh, God. Oh, smoke. Wow. I can't believe we're already in the fight. Guys are freaking huge. Yeah, I hope your bud catches. Okay, good. He's gonna get pissed that we're watching the cutscene, but fuck it, we're watching the cutscene. So this is the hardest boss in the game. Yeah, it's the hardest uh, two boss in the game. The double feature. Man, they look so cool. Oh shit. I hope he's down with killing Ornstein first. I have no idea what he's going to try to do. I feel like that's how you have to do it. I'll let him start damaging Ornstein and I'll take Smo's aggro. It's really a battle of philosophies. <laughs> okay. Slow down. <laughs> Smo down. WWE Slam. Welcome to Raw. Oh, I have to heal for him to heal, I'm pretty sure. There we go. Really? Wait, what? Yeah, it's kind of broken. It's dumb. That's so weird. I wish I had more S's when I started this fight. <laughs> Dude, I think that all the time. Can you backstab him? No. Oh, that'd be sweet. Is he hurt or something? Yeah, he's hurt. Hey. I thought I would stagger him. Oh, come on. Oh. Did it, boys. Boss fight over. Yeah. Oh, shit. Snow spawns, like, right on top of me. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> This could be very bad. No! Dude, he just 
disrespected a brother. I'm sorry, is this the Nameless King? Shit, dude. He just killed Pikachu. Oh, shit. Whoa. That's pretty fucked up. You got lucky. I got good. Calm down. Fuck. That's oh, he did zero damage, too. Hit his hammer, man. I'm gonna top off. You gotta hit that hot bod without his flames. I hate this. Like, Super Smo sucks. Like, he's easier than Super Ornstein, but... Yeah, what is Super Ornstein like? He's just big. Seriously? Yeah. He just put on his buddy's armor? No. <laughs> That'd be great. You see him take off the armor just piece by piece. Put it on himself. I just gotta balance it. I've never... I, I don't think I've done this fight with an NPC. I probably have. I probably did it with, like, Aaron or someone. But it's just a balancing act now. I think he actually resists fire. I shouldn't be doing this. Oh, that was sweet. We stunned him. Nice. Get off my friend. Hey, buddy. How about you back up? Hey, papi. Damn. Get him. The thing... So, playing this on Soul Level 1 got me pretty good at this fight, I guess. And I just know, like, what attacks to punish on. Yeah. Because, um, like, when he, when he puts his head down and just run straight at you, you just gotta hope and pray that he doesn't kill you. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Only in my dreams. I guess I'll heal that guy all the way, because I'm a nice person. Whoa. So, it's just you. You're healing for both of you guys? Yeah. That's so weird, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> Whoa, boy. Oh, my goodness. And that attack, that that can one-shot you, the butt slam. I'm sure. Oh, man. That would have been good to punish on. I'm a dummy. Dead. Mistakes. Yeah. Not even hard. Bye-bye. Well, oh. we got to message him. Oh, oh. I don't know how to use the PlayStation stuff. Do you want to message him? Um, shoot. Let me see. Let me see if we can do this. I don't know if there's a way to see your recent players on the PlayStation 3. I don't even know where it would be, honestly. Uh, I don't think there is a way to see people that you've recently played with. R.I.P. Because that's the only way to do it on the PS4 with people who play Dark Souls. There's probably a... What's on the right? That looks like friends and stuff. Can we just, like, um... Players met. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> okay, here we go. Create message. Um... You are famous. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what we should do. Uh, where's our... There it is. I guess it's here. I like that it gives you options. <laughs> is this gonna be in the episode <laughs> yeah okay hopefully he'll reply by the end of the app um check out <laughs> 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 no i feel bad just, just self-promoting like that <laughs> just be like check out permarag games next month when this episode goes up <laughs> I like the idea that our, like, through narrative is just us shilling out this channel to literally everyone who will listen to us. In a few weeks. <laughs> I 
I feel like dirty. <laughs> That's pretty funny though. Who's this guy? What's kind of what, ga- what games we got? DVR. <laughs> We're just gonna yeah. <laughs> what kind of games this guy play, huh? Oh my god, this is a uh, let's play a Dark Souls, everybody. Man, this is taking a long time. He's played so many games. <laughs> <laughs> He's only level eight. I'm like level fourteen, and I don't feel like I've played a lot of games. I don't know. Check the trophies. I don't know how what level I am. Somewhere in the teens, though. Eleven. Somewhere between eleven and fourteen. Twelve. <laughs> okay. Well, I was right. <laughs> Dark Souls, Demon Souls. Whoa. We, well, no, I've only played Trial of the Light. <laughs> okay, wait. No, which ones have we played together? He has zero trophies. Oh, these are just all my games? I don't know how this works. Have we just played none of the same games? What's that 92% thing by his name? It's how far he is in the level, I think. So he's close to being level 9. Oh. He's played... How many played... He hasn't played any games. Okami HD. Oh, here we go. Metal Metal Gear Gear Solid. Solid. Okay, Metal Gear... It's all Metal Gear. (laughs) (laughs) The only games he's played are Dark Souls and Metal Gear. (laughs) <laughs> oh okay journey wait i've beaten journey i don't i didn't get any of the trophies um infamous okay cool have we played okay i go <laughs> this guy's the weebiest person no he's played every infamous game this guy's such a weird gamer <laughs> oh i actually mad respect i love that game <laughs> he is very weeby though yep neiman souls Hasn't played... Oh, not Scholar of the First Sin. He's played the original one. Not 3? Jeez, dude. Three's, oh, three's not on PS3. Maybe he doesn't have PS4. Well. That was interesting. Back to the Let's Play, I guess. Yep. <laughs> just a little aside there. <laughs> yeah, just real quick. Wait, I don't want to quit the game. How do I... Okay. Okay. Well, there's a... Uh, oh, I should have just said GG No Re. Speaking of no, cool elevators... This, yeah, oh my gosh, dude. This left one for Ornstein. Yeah, it looks familiar. And uh, this right one is for Smo because it's big. But in Dark Souls 3, they're the same size. Yeah. It's dumb. That is weird. It's a dumb thing. Well, they're both big, aren't they? Yeah. Well, they're both medium. They split the difference. <laughs> <laughs> well, this was the Anne Orlando slash Ornstein Smo episode. <laughs> Slash us shelling out our YouTube channel. <laughs> I, uh, Sorry, DBRC12. I think this is going a little long, but let's let's can we just do a long boy? Sure. Okay. Because I know this is going to be the last one of this session, and I want to make sure we do a couple things. Whoa! The chamber of the princess. Dusk comes hidden, child. She's got a big personality. Yeah. Why? So now we have the Lord Vessel. Do you think uh, Miyazaki just really likes the movie Dude, Where's My Car? It's possible. If you have seen that movie, you understand that reference. Yeah. But if you don't, how could you possibly? I think that's how references work. Yeah. That's what I hear. <laughs> That's why I never cite my sources and papers blur. for uh, all my references and papers. You got gotcha, I, yeah, I yeah. never cite my sources. I'm like, professor, if you've read this article, yeah. you, you would know. And if you haven't, how could you possibly understand? Yeah. So there's really no point in me referencing it. So all we got to do now is say hi to a blacksmith, right? Sweet. Which one? The giant blacksmith. Sweet. And you know what the giant blacksmith? The guy who's totes dead. Yeah, he's totes dead in, the, in Dark Souls 3. But do you know what the giant blacksmith sells, Robert? Uh, sh- Titanite shards. Probably, but... Okay, uh, <laughs> <laughs> what does he actually sell? Check it out, check it out. I was right, by the way. Whoa! We're not going to get the helm? No, because we wear the mask. Oh, that's right. But, I don't know if we can wear this stuff without the mask yet. 
without being over encumbered. I don't know, man. We got a lot. Shit. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, not even one piece. Maybe just all eggs? I don't know. We'll worry about it later off screen. Just the boots. Just the boots and cats. Uh, we're gonna need a lot of these. Whoa. We're gonna need one more. Can we upgrade right now, though? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Because I think next time... Yes. Next time we can, uh... Yeah, we probably just cut it right here, huh? Uh, one sec, one sec, one sec, one sec, one sec. Wait. Wait, wait. Menus suck. Okay. Oh, now gosh. we can cut it because we have nine green shards. Ooh. Next time we're going to go do bone zone. Wait, what? 